This video is for people that have security cams on their house and would like to have a convenient way to look at the recordings. Uh, MB is a uh, media player, plays different uh, devices, but it will also play your uh, recordings from your um, security camera, which is pretty slick. Okay, look, let me go back. Okay, it goes by the, uh, this is 2018, 1227, it's December the 27th, p.m. It starts, it makes a new folder every day, one for a.m. and one for p.m. And then it creates those uh, files there. So every time it sees a motion, it clicks, uh, sets a file. Now this particular one is um, pointing down my driveway. I guess like the old people that uh, used to sit out on their front porch and watch the traffic go up and down the road in front of their house. I guess that's what I've resorted to instead of sitting out on the front porch. I, I guess I got to watch it here on my computer or my tablet that's next to my TV or whatever. But anyway, this is a modern way of the old people did it. Again, these are all the ones that, now this one, this one was December the 24th, Christmas Eve, and that was my granddaughter getting into her car, getting ready to leave. And it was a total of about two minutes long. Okay, there she is, getting in the car now. But it's so easy to find something that you want to, uh, if you suspected something, you just call it up and you can see what it was. So anyway, that's what it is. But you can go back several days. Now this one is running on my uh, NAS, so the, the uh, the camera is mounted on externally, pointed down the driveway, and it comes, feeds into a uh, Ethernet switch, then connects into my network. Now I got it uh, using a DVR, actually it's NVR, network uh, uh, digital recorder uh, that records everything from that camera. So I use my uh, Synology NAS as my camcorder for that particular camera. So if I want to do that, any particular day, of course this is night time, but actually the uh, the uh, camera, I paid $125 for it, and it supposedly it has got pretty good uh, night vision, so, but this is the night vision, not bad, not bad, again that's at 7.30 in the morning, and it's still night time, but I've got it set up where uh, any car that goes down the road, it automatically makes a recording of it, so. That's why I have so many recordings. I could have it just uh, in front of the, the house here and not the driveway there. I wouldn't have as many recordings, but it doesn't matter. So that's what I've got. That's the way I set it up. Uh, but again, the night vision is pretty doggone good. The last time I used the night vision was uh, late in 1968. Had a big old starlight scope you used on your shoulder. And it was not very good, but I used it in 1968 in the the mountains in Vietnam tried to pick out the enemy using that starlight scope. But anyway, it didn't work very well. But this is what I want to show you. So it's very convenient, extremely convenient. But again, this is an MB app. If you've got your own, uh, uh, if you've got your own uh, uh, media, like your. Uh, um, if you've uh, ripped your Blu-rays or DVDs and put them on your NASA's or external storage device, you don't have to go and pull out those DVDs and Blu-ray discs and find them and put them in the players and all that stuff. So uh, this is what this is for. So it's got a lot of good eye candy. But anyway, uh, again, uh, camera uploads. Any picture I take on my camera, it automatically uploads it to this device. So. It's, uh, I can look at it on the TV automatically as soon as I take the picture it automatically pops up here and I can uh, save it to my uh, hard drive. 
So that's what it is. That's what I want to show you. But it, for its convenience, this is absolutely perfect. Now, I also have an NVR with my other four cameras hooked up to the TV also. But I have to, it's a little bit more painful to, uh, to use. I have to go change the input on the uh, TV, which is button on my remote. Then I got to use a mouse on it. This I don't have to. It's all there. Just use my remote. Again, it creates a lot of files because every time a car goes down the road, it creates a file, a video clip. But I set it up that way, but other people may not want to, but I do. So that's what I've got. So That way it's going to be sitting out on the porch watching the traffic go up and down. I sit here and watch it on my TV. Makes it a lot easier. All right, that's what I want to show you. Thank you. Okay, now also next to my TV, I took an old 10-inch tablet that I had laying around that I haven't used in two or three years. So I stuck it to the wall, and it's a uh, display real-time. So it is a real-time display of my camera. So I've also got that. And also, when I'm sitting at my desk, I've also got a cell phone. One of my old cell phones that was in a drawer, I pulled it out, and it's also a live monitor, so I can uh, watch the driveway if anybody pulls in or anything, it's there, I can see it all the time, so it's convenient to watch the, on my TV to watch the recordings, and I've got the little uh, phone, 5-inch cell phone that I had here on my desk, and I got the 10-inch uh, tablet on the wall. So that's what I got. Thank you.